All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Single Over Servitude. So we're going to check out some couple videos today, probably from TikToks, but uh, people finding these influencers and what they do to receive attention and validation throughout the internet. Now, these are not the kind of ladies that you want to bring home to meet mom. Maybe a quick uh, romp in the hay, but a quick uh, screw, nut, and bolt. That's what they are. So let's uh, get right into this. So the first video. Got a lady. Obviously, um, recording her backside, because I guess maybe that's all she has to offer to the world. Obviously, for people, you know, seeking attention for her DMs. Maybe she's trying to get an NBA star, maybe an athlete. But, you know, ladies, is if this is the kind of stuff that you advertise, I ain't buying. I want a girl I can actually have a decent conversation with, not some girl who just, oh, this is all I have to offer, my brown eye. Not for me. Not for me. Sorry. And then our next video. Now, this one's interesting because... You see the guy in the video, and he's recording the girl. Oh, there it is. Um, now I'm just now you can tell that most likely now I have no idea, but most likely that guy is probably her boyfriend. Now, if this is her boyfriend, and I don't know if it is or not, but if it is, oh, it is. you know she's the one wearing the pants in the relationship. And what kind of self-respecting guy? would take videos of this, of his girl like this. Because you know she's going to put it on the internet and seek validation. But what he's probably not aware of is she's trying to search. She's trying to monkey branch. She's trying to find the higher rung. Like, okay, this guy's great for now, but if I can show this and I can get banker Chad or businessman Chad or athlete Tyrone or whatever it is, and she's going to trade up. She's going to be all hypergamous and take advantage of the situation that, unfortunately, this guy's being the cameraman in. So, guys, if you have any sense of self-respect, don't ever do this. Even if it's for a stranger, let alone your girl. This is just, this is horrendous. Just, once again, women objectifying themselves and then blaming men for when we do it to them. You don't want it done to you, don't do it to yourself. That's as far as I'm concerned. But anyways, this is going to be a quick little short vid. Just wanted to bang out something uh, for the content. Give you something, guys, to look at and hopefully laugh at. So comment down in the section below. Let me know your thoughts. Are these the kind of girls you avoid? Do you like these kind of girls? Me? As far as I'm concerned, this kind of attention would would just disappear if guys didn't give it to them. Or this kind of content, I should say, would just disappear if guys didn't constantly validate them. Oh, thumbs up. Oh, you a queen. Yeah, slay girl, slay, and all this stupid nonsense. And I'm not even saying that you should give the girls hate. Don't even give them the, don't even give them the negative attention. Just give them nothing. Have their DMs be like the Sahara Desert, just no life. Nothing. And then they'll stop putting out that content. Maybe hopefully girls can get better. If dumbass guys stop giving the thumbs up and validating poor behavior way to get rid of poor behavior stop you know validating it with your likes is even bad publicity is good publicity but whatever this is jeremy stone i will catch you guys next time